This week, Intellectual Property Management Office is at CoICT, where we have opened the training, intellectual property training. Uh, the response has been very uh, overwhelming. The staff are eager to learn about intellectual property, and we have planned several topics and several discussions that will enable the staff of CoICT identify intellectual property and know how to protect intellectual property. We've uh, specifically discussed intellectual property policy of the University of Dar es Salaam and how Intellectual Property Management Office is trying to implement the policy. Um, yesterday we learned about uh, common definitions or basic definitions of uh, the intellectual property rights, especially patents, uh, copyrights, uh, trademarks, uh, registered trademarks, etc. It was very useful our classes yesterday and especially we were delighted, especially here at the College of ICT, that the students actually own their works. Because um, we are running incubators here, um, innovation hubs, and uh, we are promoting or oh, we are promoting um, students to employ themselves. And therefore, if we are nurturing the students to become self-employed, then whatever they learn from the college, they are supposed to be their own, so that they can start their own business. But we are not sure whether they, are, they have the right to own those uh, initiatives they are doing, the innovations they are, they are working at the college. So, but yesterday, it became clear that uh, the students will own their works and that is good news for us. Uh, for today, the second day of the workshop, we are expecting to learn more from Brella and Kosota, specifically on how to register, how to use their platform, uh, and also how to search um, old things. And we want also to learn whether, for example, if I want to file my own patents, can I search myself and see if there's somebody already are uh, having such initiatives. Same for business names. We wanted to be able to search like, is my business name close to somebody else or not? And how, in general, how the platform, the Brera platform works. In the College of YCT, as I said, we have final year projects, which most of times end up uh, producing very good and relevant products. And it is very important as a university to think about how to protect them, especially when they go to commercial and uh, taking the different uh, uh, levels and stages in the future. And this pro uh, training is going to be very important and very useful in our, um, not only career as academicians, but also uh, our students' career in producing relevant and innovative products in the future. Today I was here at Co ICT where I was delivering a lecture on the regime of intellectual property system in Tanzania. Actually I focused more on the copyright where I come from. It was great to have this session with the Co ICT members where we discussed a lot about the copyright, we discussed about the trade secret, we also talked about the trademark. Uh, this is a great opportunity and it's a great thing as talking to co-ICT members, especially lecturers, they will have this knowledge and they will deliver this knowledge to their students, not only their, to their students, but also it will help them in the course of doing their work or in the course of doing their duties as they are encountering or they are coming across a lot of intellectual property things, especially in the software that they are developing, the database that they are developing, so they will know how to protect and how they are protected. So they can use it and they can deliver the message to their students on the ways that they can protect their uh, creations, their inventions. So the course is very useful for us to also um, pass the knowledge to our students when they are, maybe they are doing their projects or when staff are doing their research. So the research results, uh, what, is, what is part of it that is the intellectual property that needs to be protected. So the course is really useful 
as it is going to give us knowledge which we, we usually miss this in the past. And in, in the college we also have an incubator where we encourage students to use the knowledge and then uh, change the knowledge into business, like turning the, the knowledge they're collecting here to become job creators. So in that way as well, we'd like to know what is their rights when they are now using their knowledge and changing it into business in order to employ themselves as they work, I mean the employment is now saturated. When they create the jobs, employ themselves and employ others, what are the things to be protected when they create the, the product or the services or the processes? I'm Rafael Mtalima from uh, Business Social Real Assessing Agency. Uh, uh, coming from the Department of Intellectual Property. The relevance of the training is to make these people to understand the, 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 to understand the, uh, the IP side. And as we know, all know, in the contemporary world, the intellectual property is of, uh, most important in the, in, 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 in the world today because uh, even our economy depends much on the intellectual property. It is still useful and we really enjoy the presenters and the material that are presented. Um, it's a kind of interactive sessions. So we, uh, the, the, we are so much engaged so that we ask questions, also get clarification. Where we don't understand, we also try to um, give our opinion on the concept that we don't understand. Nikiwa kama sehemu ya wanufaika wa training hii ya siku tatu labda kwa niaba ya wenzangu ambao tumenufaika nao pamoja nitoe shukrani za dhati kwa waandaaji kwa sababu kwa shughuli ambazo tulikuwa tunazifanya na tunazoendelea kuzifanya hapa chuoni tunajua kabisa umuhimu wa haya mafunzo tulikuwa tujui mambo haya copyright procedures ikoje E, ni jinsi gani naweza nikalinda haki zangu au nikalinda haki za wengine na nini lakini tumepata vitu vingi sana katika katika training hii ya siku tatu kwa hiyo tunashukuru sasa hivi kazi imebaki kwetu kuhakikisha kwamba tuna fanya sasa kwa vitendo haya ambayo tume tumeyapata tuna patents nyingi labda za ku Dr. Justo tuna patent za kutosha sasa hivi tumefundishwa jinsi ya ku ya kufile patent ya Kwa hiyo ni, ni, ni wajibu wetu sasa kufanya hivyo. Kwa hiyo ni washukuru e, Chokikuu cha Dar es Salaam, ni washukuru wa taala mwingine waliokuja kutoka Kostek, kutoka Kosota, e, waliokuja kwa ajili ya e, kutoka Brela pia kwa ajili ya mafunzo haya. Kwa kile waliofanya nitusaidia sana na tunaahidi kwamba tutayafanyia kazi na kwa sababu Mambo tunawafanya na lazimisha tuyafanyie kazi, tuyafanyie kazi kwa likuwe. Kwa hiyo, namba tuapongeze kwa makofi matatu kwa shiria kwa mba tunarivika na utendaji uliofanyi. Asante sana. I'm here on behalf of uh, Director of Public Service, ambaye amekua absent with apology, lakini kikubwa sana ni uweza tu kusema anashuru Wa kwanza kwa management ya college kwa kuruhusu opportunity ya unit yetu ya continue education kufanya hii training lakini pia na washukuru na participant kwa muda wenu pia na kwa concentration yenu lakini kitu kikubwa pia ni kwamba sisi kama watu wa directorate of public service kwa chuo kikuu tuna, tunafanya kazi ya kutoa service to the public Kwa hiyo vitu kama hivi ni one of the supporting issues. Sasa wakati mwingine pia tuna report kwamba tumefanya training kwa ICT lakini tunaambiwa kwamba how is it sustainable? Kwa hiyo swala la sustainability linakuwa halipo kwa sisi peke yetu liko pia kwa upande wenu. Sisi tunaamini kwamba mpaka sasa hivi tumesha kufikia level ya outcome kwa maana kwamba tumesha deliver uh, training na tumesha spread knowledge to, to the people. Lakini sasa hivi impact ipo ipo upande wenu. Kwa hiyo tunategemea feedback hizo siku za nyuma tutakazokuwa tunazitoa lakini zitakuwa ni za upande wenu. Basi baada ya kusema hivyo naomba niwashukuru kwa niaba ya Director of Public Service 
kwa muda wenu na kwa ushirikiano wenu na tunaamini kwamba kitu ambacho tumekifanya kwenu kitakuwa kitu sasa mwakilishi wa kurugenzi wa public services na koordinator wa UCB IP manager tuta wote ambao mmekuja wanawasha na watarishaji wa seminar hii kwa nashukuru wote kwa kweli hii ni yani beyond my expectation ile ndio sasa tumeona kama ni siku moja kwa kweli nimesema tu kwamba kwa kweli tumefunza mengi ni mengi ambayo tulikuwa tunategemea Bukara <laughs> kwani sisi kama kwa ICT hapo tuna takriban wanafunzi 200 kila mwaka wanafanya kazi hapo kwa hiyo ikipiga hesabu miaka yote hiyo nafaa tutengeneza IP hata moja in terms of money na nikushukuru manager kwa kwa muda wa kwa mwaka mmoja tunaanza kuona na kipo the first time tunao semiti kupitia sasa ya mali extent ndio tunaona report kwamba kuna watu wa file wake na problem ni good thing kwamba yote yote wale pia wanatoka kwa Tesco kwa sababu ya hali kwamba baada ya hiyo ni kwa hiyo tunataka tena utuulize jamani sio ongeze kanga na mtu anasema asante koneta wa CCT technology wote ambao umesema lakini kumbe kwamba sisi kwa CCT bado tunanyonya kwa mambo kule kwa hiyo tuna kazi tunafanyia kule kwa hiyo tunakuwa tunapitia kule lakini kuna kazi zetu kwa hiyo tutaji tayari ku kusiana na wale wote kwa kwa rajisi ya kutekeleza haya ambayo kwa machete mashukuru sasa pesa